Hey beautiful people, it's Carrie and welcome back to my channel for the month of February. I'm going to be doing some Valentine's Day related videos so there will be definitely some song playlists because Valentine's Day just definitely puts you in your feels. Uh, some story times, some funny videos, I don't know, I love February even though I've never had a Valentine but so stay tuned for those videos. But the reason you clicked on this video was to see my January favorites. I just hit something. So first, I think we'll start with nails. So right now, my nails, I have on fake nails. And it's just matte. Like, it's lilac -y purple, but I think on camera it's showing up a little bit darker. And then I have an accent finger. And it's got, like, holographic on it. And I've been using the... The hair. I've been using the Inpress Press On Manicures and it's a one step gel. And normally I've been liking the oval pattern. Like, I know I wore this set like a couple times in the month of January and I found that the oval kind of fit my fingers better, even though that these are square. I normally like regular nails, but I really like the look of fake nails, and I was like, you know what, I have some, let's try it, and I loved it, and I'm addicted, and this is definitely my favorite kind, because it has the um, gel tab already on it, but I still use glue on top of that, because um, art and stuff, so of course, like, my nails will be doing a bunch of stuff, and I don't want it to pop off, because that'd be kind of awkward. Funny story, one of my nails actually did pop off during class, and it was the most awkwardest thing because all of a sudden you hear this loud, like, it's not like a loud crashing sound, but all of a sudden you see my fingernail on the table. But somebody looked at me, but I don't think they seen it because it was before class, so I hurried up and slapped the glue on, and even though the nail was kind of crooked that day, not these nails, but a different one, but I have so many different awkward story time videos, but... That'll be a different video. Um, so yeah, I've been giving my nails a break on polish, and it's actually making them grow longer. So, that's a plus. Next, we are going to talk about hair. So for my hair for the month of January, I've been basically just leaving it pretty natural. And then, like, I'll pull my front layers back, so, like, this little poofy thing. That's my short layers. Um, I haven't been straightening it. Used, I mean, in all my videos, my hair is basically like this. But I've been giving my hair a break from heat because, for one, it takes forever. I'm trying to be quick in the mornings. And two, it just... I don't know. I really like my hair like this. It's quick. It's easy. It's simple. And it's not too damaging on my hair. And I've been pulling my bangs, so like half of my bangs back into like a little braid kind of thing it's not really a braid but i've been doing that and i think my hair is getting a little bit longer I'm trying to let my hair grow a little bit longer and yeah i haven't i didn't dye my hair in january normally every january i touch up the roots of my hair because in case if you can't tell i'm a natural brunette and i haven't done that this month because i did it in december so yeah, that's my hair. Oh, and then the products that I've been using for my hair is the Rock Your Hair Spray It Big Volume Hairspray. And, ooh, that's loud. Guys, this smells like peaches. And it's got, and it's like a pink bottle, and it's got this cute little, like, gems on it. And it's super cute, and I love Rock Your Hair. And since I have been leaving my hair kind of curly or wavy or whatever you like to call this, it has, like, held held it pretty good. It doesn't get frizzy, and it basically keeps its shape that I want. And in case if you guys did not know, I am partnered with Rock Your Hair, so I promote their products and model my hair and whatever you want to call it. So I will always leave my link down in the description box if you ever want to get some products and if you follow me on instagram which is miss dot 
carrie.b. My social media is always linked in the description box, but I'm always posting different codes that you guys can use, so make sure you follow me and use my link in the description box because this is hecka cute and everybody loves some good hair. Next up, oh, another thing. So for shampoos, so I pretty much use always use the same shampoos on my hair because I'm very picky. But I did, since I, okay, so I had dyed my hair basically all the way like platinum blonde, which was cute for the summer, but then my roots are kind of dark because my hair is naturally, okay, my hair is kind of weird. It started off as blonde and then it got brown, like dark brown. So whenever I was platinum, I used this and it's a purple shampoo, but it's the Walmart brand, so it's really cheaper. There's a hair in my eye, sorry guys. Oh my gosh, this stuff smells so good. I love anything like minty and like the stress relief scents. It smells so good. So it is a blonde shampoo. It's by L'Oreal and it's the Ever Pure Blonde Shampoo. I don't use conditioners on my hair. I just use the shampoos because I find that kind of broke my hair too much. So I use this once every other week or every other two weeks and I lather it up and it makes my hair like really soft and it tends to not make my hair frizzy which is a plus and it smells so good like after I get out of the shower I can still smell it so that's amazing speaking of smelling real good I went to room and you know how they're always like promoting their perfumes there maybe it's just my the store that i go to but they're always like pushing perfumes well i bought a shirt there and it was the one i wore in a previous video it was the property of nickelodeon studios and if you bought like a shirt you got a perfume for half off which is really cheap and um one of my friends she always used to wear this perfume and i remember it always smelled so good and it would like last like i would like walk by her during the day and i could still smell it and it is so it smells so good i have it on right now too it's again like peaches i love the smell of peaches floral floral and peaches are my go-to scents love it it is pink ice perfect name um I got the bigger size I believe because they were half off so might as well get the bigger size go bigger go home and I've used like a little bit of it I try to be very careful but I mean I can always go back and get more I guess but I want to make this last because it is my favorite scent this month so next we're going to talk about the face so, for my makeup this month, um, I had actually not been doing the wing, but the other day, like, I kind of got dressed up, and I was like, hmm, let me go back to my OG ways and do the wing, and I've kind of been loving it lately. Like, I've been going, like, full glam, my version of full glam anyway, and I've been, like, feeling real good. So, that's always awesome. So, the mascara that I've been using is our... Like, they're pretty long right now, actually, and it's because of this. So, one thing you should know about me is that I only buy, like, on-sale mascara. I don't pay full price for mascara because it's expensive, and you put it on, and then you take it off, and it's like, I like to buy cheap stuff. So, it is the Maybelline New York, the Colossal Spider Effect Volume Express in black, and... The, I don't really care about the wands on mascaras, but I don't know if it's just because, like, this is what the wand looks like if it's why my eyelashes be popping. But, I mean, thanks. Probably New York. It's got a spider web on it, so, yeah. Love that. And then for um, eyeliners, so I used to do, like, this gray, like, chubby pencil thing on my waterline. But I recently found this, and it is super, super 
thin. So it's perfect for like the waterline and you get it like right on there. And it is the Maybelline New York Master Precise, 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 there we go. It's too early you guys, like it's only a little bit after 7, it's okay. And I don't drink coffee so. In the shade Black. And I put this down at the bottom just a wee bit, just to kind of bring in the top. The black plays with the bottom. You get me? You feel me? Yeah. And then my lips. Mm -hmm. Why do I always do that? Every time I, like, show you guys what's on my lips, I have to, like, smooch you. I'm sorry. Um, anyway. So, I discovered these. And it is the Doll 10 Lip Crayons. And oh my gosh, lip crayons are where it's at. Like, they stay on your lips. Like, okay, my lips are like this right now at 7 a.m. And whenever I come home at like, it depends on what time. I don't know, it's different every day. But it's still there. Like, I'll eat lunch and it'll still be there. Like, so good. Like, started off just using just the lip liner all over and it would, like, come off. I tried lipstick, it would come off. This does not come off and it makes my lips look, like, plump and luscious. And I'm like, yes. Um, next thing. So, to remove my makeup, I used to use these makeup. Okay, so my skin is super sensitive. So, I gotta be very, very careful on stuff I use. So, I had been using the Clean and Clear. I don't remember what kind they were, but it was the white pack. And, oh my gosh, yes, they stunk so bad. But, I found these. And it's the Clean and Clear Night Relaxing All-in-One Cleansing Wipes. And they smell good. And they, they like, cool. I mean, they, they're night relaxing, so of course they're gonna cool. But they take it off so well, and I only need to use one. So, go get these. And for Senseless Skin Sally here, they're amazing. You should go get them. I found, I rediscovered this. I had this, but I kind of stopped using it, and then I rediscovered it again. It is the Dove Sensitive Skin Nourishing Body Wash. So, every time, like, okay, this is like a girl thing, but... Whenever you shave your legs, you get razor bumps. So I use this like immediately after shaving my legs. And oh my gosh, you guys, my legs are so soft now. Like they feel like butter. So, and then two, it prevents the razor bumps. So, very good. And it smells, I mean, it smells medicated. So, but I don't really mind the scent of this. But it's kind of a mix between like, a baby wipe or something like that. But it smells good. Like, you might gonna stink. It's just sometimes people don't like the smell of medicated stuff. I happen to not mind it if it does the trick. It's all good. And for clothing. So, you guys, I have... Why do I keep clapping? I'm so excited. Um, you probably already know what my favorite clothing item this month because I literally wear it all the time it is I can't even fit it on frame my Dolan Twins hoodie literally oh there's another string here we go Dolan Twins hoodie I got mine in white they come in black or white and oh my gosh you guys it is seriously the most comfiest thing in the whole entire world and it fits me good like I love it. I love it. I love it. Like, this is like a display item. Amazing. You can't even see. It's so amazing. And they're amazing. And, yeah, like, they make me so happy. Like, anytime I watch their videos. So, just by wearing this, it, like, boosts my mood. Like, 110%. Like, so amazing. So comfy. And I'm not just exaggerating. Like, it's literally the most comfiest thing ever. Like, I wear it too much. And people probably think this is all I own. I don't have it on now, but I wanted to show you guys. Good. And then two. Again, I don't want people to think I only have one thing. Ugh, I feel like I'm getting a cold. And the last thing. We're going to end this video with some tunes. So we are going to end this video with my top 
two favorite songs. I couldn't narrow it down just to one. And one of them's like for older kids, and one of them can be for younger kids, teens, whatever you like to call it. Um, and then two for the first song, "Why" by Bozzy Bazzy. I don't know for sure I pronounce his name, but mind you, this song is not for younger kids. But I'm 17. So it pretty new or at least it's really new to me i seen a lot of people promoting it on instagram and stuff and i loved one of his other songs that he wrote so just listen they don't fucking trust me they probably all right though i know i'm an asshole but you can't find the keys now that was that song. It just has like a good beat and it's like i love how it's like storming in the background. It's like really puts you in the mood. And the final song is Perf by Baby Ariel. Um, she is one of, like, she's, like, the most popular person on Musical.ly. And her aesthetic on these videos are so bright and colorful. And the songs are just so, like, lighthearted and, like, they're really cheesy. But your girl loves cheese. So here it is. Swear to God, it's like I don't really have a baby. You don't gotta play hard, already an all star. Cause you're so perf. Everything you do is so perf. Wake up in the morning, so perf. You ain't even. Uh oh, I think I'm in deep like therapy. Can you sit right there? I'll tell you what. So, yes, this was my favorites for the month of January. Stay tuned for February's videos. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe. Keep smiling, beautiful people. I love you.